also hello, welcome to, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Emma, and if you're not new here, my name is still Emma. Today I'm here with Sage, and we are currently literally, wait, where's the sky tower? <laughs> We're in the middle of Auckland City because Owen's got work at the moment, so he's working at the classic, like the Cheers Classic. I can say that now because by the time this vlog goes up, he'll be finished at work. So he's working there, so he's just gone to work now, it's like nine o'clock, and he brought us up as well. So we're now walking from there to catch the ferry to Waikiki for the day. So you guys are coming along with us, <laughs> and we we're saying before, we've literally been talking about doing this trip to Waikiki for like years <laughs> like at least two years. And if you guys don't know, Sage lives in Australia, so we can't just like, you know, hop on the ferry and just go. We're trying to aim to get on the ferry at 9.30, so it's like two minutes to nine now. So if we get on the 9.30 ferry, get there to stuff 10. What time do we come back? Maybe like between like three and five, I reckon? Yeah, sometime between three and five. And then we've got dinner back in Auckland here with my brother and mum and dad are coming up. And then we'll go get Owen from work. And then we'll go out for dinner at Kura, a Japanese restaurant, which I've vlogged there before. Okay, this show is really loud. I'll see you guys in the ferry. Thank you. We're in Waiheke. We went to go jump on this bus and we're like, the guy's like, no, it's this one. So we're going on the double decker bus. But we missed the 9.30 ferry by like two minutes. And then we went and jumped in the line. There were literally hundreds of people waiting to the ferry. So we got on the 10 o'clock one. And it's now like nearly 11 o'clock. I thought <gasps> that was the one we were on. That is so cool. That is cool. So we hopped off the bus like after a few stops and now, now we're waiting for it. But we hopped off and had a look at like a little market. We are looking at jigsaws and stuff and a lady was like trying to sell us one and I was like we do not have room to take this bag. But we've decided that we're thinking we're going to catch the bus, like the tour bus thing the whole way around the island. And then go back to like Oniroa which is like the main town and grab some lunch and then maybe go down to the beach. And then maybe head back to Auckland at like 3-ish because then we can go and have a look at the tennis. Slip, stop, slap. <laughs> okay, we've made it to what is this place called? Is it Oniroa? Um, yeah. Yeah, Oniroa Beach, and we're just chilling in the sun. It is 20 minutes past one. I'm gonna chill here in the sun. Don't know if I go for a swim. I can't even be bothered getting wet. <laughs> Those people screaming over there make me think it might be kind of cold. We found shade, but we've decided we're gonna catch the three o'clock ferry back to Auckland and then we should get back to the tennis by the time we walk from the ferry at like quarter past four and then go dump our bits in the car and then we're going to go see if we can surprise Owen in this little forest. But look how pretty. Okay, it's 4.23 and we're back at the car now, but we ended up like scootering back on, what were they called? Neuron scooters, eh? Yeah. So, I guess they're Lime's replacement, but they're actually pretty good. I feel like they're better than Lime. I feel like they're like fancier. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to go and see if we can see Owen at work and go see his little forest. And then come back and maybe head down to Mission Bay for an ice cream. Mm -hmm. It is very hot. I have not got my camera with me, but we're now at Mission Bay. So we just parked up the car <laughs> and we went to go look at Owen's forest and there well, he wasn't there, he was doing another job, so we didn't get to go look in there, but I kind of like look from the gate and look pretty cool. But now we're gonna go and grab an ice cream, and I was gonna be finished work at like six, so it's like five now, so if we have like 40, well by the time we walk there, like 40-ish minutes, and we head back and pick him up, and then I don't know what we'll do, because dinner's not till 7.30, so we have an hour and a half to kill. So we might see if we can change the dinner booking, otherwise we might go do something fun like walk up One Tree Hill. Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> All right. Um, let's go get ice cream. Little story time. So if you're from New Zealand and Auckland, you probably would have seen people handing out these, right? Well, the guy was trying to like, he like pulled Sage aside and he's like, can I, 
book you in for an yeah. appointment on Sunday. Um, did he say when? No, he just said no. He just said, "Can I book an appointment?" And you're like, "What?" And then he like repeated himself, and then you say like, when or something. Yeah, I was yeah. like, "What's the appointment for?" Yeah, he's like to better us on Sunday or something. Yeah, and we're just like, "What?" So I'm, I'm yet to lay a complaint on these thing, but like mm. that's really weird. Travel together when you're at Mission Bay. Yeah, travel together. <laughs> travel in numbers at Mission Bay. I wouldn't. As I said, finishing work apparently in like half now because it's 5.30 now. So I just chill here for like 15 minutes and then head back to pick them up and hopefully not get abused on the way out. Yeah. Is, it still, is it still there? I don't know, I can't see. There you go. Ugh. Alright, we're back to pick up Owen now. It's like 10 past 6, so he's not finished yet. So we're just gonna chill and wait for him because dinner's not till 7.30 and we're literally already in Auckland, so there's not really much point in us doing anything. My feet are sore. Yeah, so am I. My shoes are not very sportive. And then we're going to eat sushi. Yeah, I'm, I'm hanging out for some teriyaki eel and avocado. Oh, I wasn't oh. recording. We picked up Owen and we're now at the viaduct and we got a park because Sage and Spirit Fingers <laughs> and Spirit Fingers always get parks. Facts, guys, it's facts. So we're gonna go and just have a cruise around and have a look and see. But it's quarter to seven, so dinner. We don't plan to leave for dinner for like another half hour. So let's we'll walk around and see what we can find. And then here's a dinner. Is there water leaking? Hope it's not leaking over all our stuff. All right, we finished up the viaduct and I'm gonna get copyrighted. Finished the viaduct, so we're heading into the Civic Car Park now. And we're gonna meet mum and dad here in like three minutes. Left, right here. That's left. Left, sorry, left. So, Spirit Finger Sage, we can get a car park. Yeah. Never like. Yeah. That's why I wanted you to drive because I don't like. We should have parked in the car park out in front of, like, down below Kura. Yeah, we could have. <laughs> but then Mr. GM might come out and tell us that his Porsche is taking up too many car parks and we can't park there. Told ya. What do you know? It's a beautiful car park. It works like a charm. Time to go get some sushi. Okay, hi, I'm just editing this now, but I'm just gonna jump in here just to give this next clip a little bit of context. So basically, we were at this Japanese restaurant, which we go to all the time, and we always order this drink called ramen which is basically like a bubblegum flavored Japanese fizzy drink, like like lemonade pretty much. And it comes in this bottle and it's sealed with like a little marble that's like, is where like the opening of the bottle is. So to break the seal, you get like this little plastic bit that it comes with and you like push it down and that drops the ball in and that the carb it carbonates the drink and whatever. And we get them at home, like we buy them from Japan Mart and had the drinks at home. But when we had them at the Japanese restaurant, they always crack the marble in for us. And I asked the lady when I ordered one for um, Owen and I, I was like, oh, can you bring them out without them cracked so we can do it ourselves? And she's like, yeah, yeah, all good. So she brought them out and then she's like, make sure when you pop it, you hold the thing down because otherwise all the drink will come up out of the top of like the lid. Anyway, Anyway, I was like, no, like I've done this before, that's not gonna happen. Anyway, I didn't get my bit on film, but the drink basically went everywhere, but I'll let you see what happened to Owen and Matt. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Is it done? Is it good? I think it's good. Oh, you, can take it, you can take it off now. Nah. It's so busy. Dinner is all done, I didn't record it. It's not a current dinner unless he even gets a vlog from me. What was that? Nothing. Thumbnail? Cool. Alright, this is the entrance to Kura, so you can see how dodgy it looks. It's like up the top of Queen Street, kind of. I don't think I'll still look long out in public. We have ended going? up at the arcade. I wanted to go to one new market, but it's R18, so I couldn't get in. So now we're here. We're in his natural habitat. Easy way to get tickets. I mean, do you get 40? I don't know, nah. Yeah, you get 40. Yeah. Finishing up at the arcade, I got four of these. We got four little thingies, and Matt got three lollies, and now we're going to the car. And it's nearly 10 o'clock. Tired? Yeah. Hi, it's now like Tuesday, so it's like three days later and realized I'd never close off this vlog but it's going up tomorrow so I'm editing it now. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you made this fun the video please give a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already love to have your it's free. Love free stuff. Make someone smile and I'll see you in my next video. Bit noisy traffic. Bye. Oh, oh god jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs>
gonna just lay home. We're just gonna start these garden ones.